Hey guys, this is your girl Joanna back with another video for you guys. How are you? I'm doing good. My kids actually started, um, you know, online school from home last week. So it took some adjusting, but this week was a lot better because they kind of know exactly what they need to do now. So um, yeah, I'm just trying to balance out my business and you know my youtube channels and then just helping them with school so so yeah just trying to figure it all out but anyway i haven't done a, a recipe in a long time for you guys so i thought i'd bring you along as i make dinner tonight i'm making this delicious super simple salad i mean like a last minute you know simple delicious salad that could go with um any kind of meat i'm making it with steak tonight um so yeah, come along and see. All right, the things that you'll need for the salad is cucumbers. I have two cucumbers, the long ones. I have these tomatoes. Um, I got the one, the package that has the yellow and the reds. Just so, you know, more color. You're gonna need some red wine vinegar, some olive oil, an avocado, and a red onion, some feta cheese, and um, also some parsley if you have some i totally forgot about it but parsley would be really good on it um so what you're gonna do is just you're gonna chop up everything into small pieces so chop up your cucumber your cherry tomatoes chop them in half avocado into small pieces as well your onions into small pieces and that's pretty much about it okay guys so i'm done chopping everything up like i said add some parsley i just didn't have any so i got my cucumbers i didn't even take off the uh, i like the peel actually so the avocado the tomatoes in half the onions i added my feta so now we're just gonna make the dressing so like i said you're gonna need your red wine vinegar your olive oil and some pepper have something to pour it into can you help me on that so we're gonna do um a teaspoon of red wine vinegar so this is half a teaspoon so we have to do two okay so basically a teaspoon of red wine vinegar so two of those okay because this is half perfect now we're going to do uh two teaspoons of olive oil two teaspoons of olive oil so that's going to be four of these okay yeah four one oh that was a lot two ooh, two do a little less on this one. Three, and then one more. Four, perfect. And then you're just gonna put some, some black, um, pepper. black pepper, go for it. So yeah, pretty simple, huh? You can even add a little bit of lemon if you want. I think I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon. Go ahead. Keep going, keep going, girl. Perfect. Okay. So go get that piece of lemon over there. I'm actually thinking I'm going to add a little bit of a you know, little touch. Yeah. You can make it without or you can make it with. It's up to you if you like the lemon flavor. All of it? Yeah. Just squeeze it in there. Or maybe like half of it. Yeah. Just squeeze like half of it. Stop. A little bit more. And then just get a, a spoon and mix it up. Or, yeah, a spoon. Or, yeah, get a spoon. This is so simple to make guys like super simple and i just love like all the colors and everything i usually get the low fat feta but they didn't have the one i usually get so i had to get the regular one but yeah so yeah once it's ready you're just going to pour it let's taste it first it still tastes like like a lot a lot like vinegar add a little bit more lemon I can still taste the red wine vinegar. Put a little bit more pepper. Just needs a little bit more flavor. But yeah, with the parsley, you know, you'll have a nice green leaf in there. I just didn't have any right now. It's not working. A little bit more. Okay, that's good. Now mix it up again. Okay, perfect. Now it should be perfect. Maybe we should, add, should we add a little bit of salt? Huh? Mmm. 
Okay, get the little, get the salt. We'll probably add a little bit of salt. Okay, so we're gonna add a little bit of pink. Himalayan pink salt. You don't have to, it's an option. Like I said, you guys could play with it, do whatever you, uh oh, you okay? You can leave the salt out or not. You can even just do it with like olive oil and lemon and pepper. That tastes just as good if you don't like the red wine vinegar taste. Go ahead. Is it coming out? Mm-hmm. You're doing it hard? Okay, just mix it up now. And then, mix, 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 all right, mix, now mix. pour it. Oh, no, no, I was going to say pour it in, but let me take a picture first, guys. Okay, so now you just add your mix. And then you just toss it. Yummy. You need a bigger spoon so you can toss it. Meanwhile, she gets a bigger spoon. Let me show you guys what I'm gonna serve it with. I actually got some New York steaks, three of them. That one's better. Yeah, and um, yeah, I just put some seasonings on there and marinate it with lemon juice. And um, yeah, I put some of these leaves as well. Um, so yeah, and I just made a little bit of white jasmine rice already. It's already cooked. Yeah, simple, simple dinner. I'm gonna serve it with the salad, of course. Okay, ready? Let's mix. But be careful, don't like smash it, just kind of like mix it, you know? Mm-hmm. It looks so good. Yep. All right, while she mixes, I'm gonna put the steaks on the grill. <laughs> like you can literally eat the salad by itself. That's how good it is. Maybe with a little bit of non bread. Cause look at Lily. All right, don't eat it up all, okay? Cause you gotta save us for me and Dad. Oh no! All right, so I just wanted to show you guys. I actually put a little bit of rosemary on the steak. That just gives it a lot of flavor. Yep. I like it nice and brown. So. Yeah, I'm gonna save it along with the rice. I'll show you guys after I put it all together. Um, the lighting is horrible, but this, I just wanted to show you guys how I'm presenting it. Just the steak, a little bit of rice, and of course the salad. The hubby didn't want any rice because he's on a low carb diet. Not diet, but like he's just trying not to eat rice. It's a diet, yeah. And so I got my wine. I'm about to sit down and relax and enjoy it. Okay, guys, that was absolutely delicious. It is so good. Um, it doesn't taste as good the next day. So if you're gonna make it, make sure you just make enough for the people that you know that are eating for the day, because um, it's not as good the next day. But it is absolutely de delicious. I really love it. It was like I said, super simple. It went perfect with the steak. Um, Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you guys subscribe and like it if you haven't um, liked it or subscribed. Make sure you do so. And thank you for watching. I'll talk to you later. Bye.